Hey there, how you doing? Charlie Winters here with a ramble and a what might seem an absolutely nut job of a prediction. Right. Um, I hate to use the term conspiracy theorist, but I'm going to use it uh, because I'm looking at the, the two FA Cup matches, and um, I don't, I don't follow football like I used to. I like a bet on it, but um, I think this is the semi-finals. I could be wrong; it could be quote, but I think it's the semi-finals. Um, Manchester City versus Chelsea, and Coventry, Coventry versus Manchester United. Well. There always seems to be some kind of story or tagline, um, or the commentator always comes out, oh, and it's his, he scores on his birthday, or he rides a win of the Grand National, on his, but you've heard it all. Well, the two matches today have got script possibly written all over it. So, as you're well aware, um, Cole Palmer is all over the headlines for, um, for being on fire. Um, so... He comes up against his former club, Manchester City. So, if you want to get me, in, me into the conspiratorial and who runs the world and all that kind of thing. So, you've got the Freemasons. So, the high, I think it's the highest order of masonry is 33. Right, we're going deep now. This will be literally for 30 seconds, right? I'm going for two outsiders. I'm, I'm going to watch them more than anything else. I might have a... A small amount on them, but you got Manchester City, possibly Erling Haaland not playing, so already they're putting doubts in people's minds. Um, oh, so I think it could be Chelsea that go through in this match, and I think it'll they'll all be talking about Cole Palmer, and it's like, oh, he's got one over on his former club, yeah. Manchester, they'll you they could possibly use the um, the reason for the uh, they were hung over from the uh, the exit of the um. Champions League, was it semi-final? Um, bearing in mind, can you remember, I don't know if you watch the channel. Um, I don't watch the channel. I watch it highlights on YouTube. And it's the Kate Abdo. And she predicted Manchester City versus Arsenal final. They both got eliminated that night. Well, I'm sure that a lot of them people are predicting a Manchester City versus Manchester United FA Cup final. Well, I'm also going to go for two underdogs. So I'm going to go for Chelsea and I'm going to go for Cole Palmer to be um, heavily involved. Do what you want with that. Um, what I do tend to think, if think, if you want things scripted, it's so much easier to do it via penalty shootouts. Yeah, remember, the, was it the World Cup? Where it was the Argentina beat France? And it ended up 3 all after extra time, I believe. Three and three, as I was saying, is the highest order in Mason, uh, in the Freemasons, right? The highest order in, in Freemasons is 33, right? I'm predicting a Chelsea versus Coventry final. Chelsea, let's turn these into numbers. The third letter of the alphabet, A, B, C. C for Chelsea is three. A, B, C. The C for Coventry is a three. It's 33, Wow, we're going deep today. So I'm predicting a Chelsea versus Coventry final. Right. So let's talk about ex-players doing one over on the former club. You've got Mark Robbins, the current manager of Coventry, was also the FA Cup. Um, did they used to call him the Super Sub? I think it was um, Super Sub. He used to come on and uh, turn the games in. Well, it weren't just the, the FA Cup. They reckon it was the man who kept Sir Alex Ferguson in a job when they were really under pressure. And I can see Mark Robbins doing one over on his former club, therefore pre uh, preventing the most um, obvious final, the Manchester final, which could be a tale of two former um, pros getting one over on the former club. And just be conspiratorial, or you've got the threes involved to keep mentioning. So I think... <laughs> I'm going very deep. I know it's going to blow most people's minds. And I can, I can see people going, doo, doo, with, with the subscribe button, as in like, no thanks, I don't want any more of this. But how many times have you seen, like, oh, it seems scripted. And I know uh, there's an awful lot of people now um, questioning things that are going off, uh, as in like, a lot of things seem scripted. Are they scripted? You tell me in the comments. But... Um, all I'm getting recently is um, decodes and script have come up in my, YouTube, in my YouTube feed. So I don't know if they're reading my mind or what. But I'm going to predict a Chelsea versus Coventry final, which don't get me wrong, it's, it's by far the biggest odds. And it's probably not going to happen. 
but I'm giving you the reasons why, because I, I no longer trust these. Um, so you've got Chelsea and Coventry final. The easiest way is probably to via penalties. So I'll leave it up to you what you decide to do. But all I'm saying is, don't always follow the obvious. So the very best of luck, Charlie Conspiracy Theory Winters over and out.